A lot of times when we go out to look at a kitchen or bath, we don't automatically recommend replacing. It depends on the condition of the cabinets and whether they're really fitting into the way that the kitchen needs to be used by the customer. So this is a kitchen, for example, where we did a partial replacement on just that peninsula that you look at right now. And the rest of it is the original cabinets. We replaced all of the doors. We installed new doors and with with a uh, factory finish on them. And then on the cabinet boxes themselves, we refinished those in the field. And this is the final product. Notice the end panels on the end of the uh, lower and upper cabinets. You can see that the finish that we can achieve on these new doors is really outstanding. And when you put the new doors on the refinished boxes, it looks like a brand new cabinet, even though you didn't have to replace the cabinet and go to the expense of that. So there's a real value in rehabbing an existing kitchen if the kitchen can be used the way you still want to use it. I'm going to go through and show you some before and afters in just a minute. One of the, the changes we made was to add that dish uh, rack above the kitchen sink. You'll see how it was before. But And there's the island, or actually the peninsula. We incorporated a Lazy Susan in there that wasn't there before, and we added a foot to that length of cabinets. Inside each one of the cabinets as well, we added conveniences such as pullouts. That's a charging station. This is the back of the peninsula. We put on cabinet doors so you can actually access the cabinet from either side of that peninsula. Okay, here's what it looked like before, and here's what it looks like now. A huge difference in the way that the kitchen responds, the way that, that it's ultimately used uh, by putting in that, that uh, Lazy Susan. Here's what it was before, just a place to keep uh, pill bottles. And now it's it's really a, just an attractive kitchen. Here's the cooking wall, and here's what it looks like now. Uh, all new appliances, that really helps. They had the refrigerator before, but uh, the microwave and cooktop are all new. And uh, had we, uh, sometimes we'd recommend to build a refrigerator box, but not, not in this case. Um, you can see just adding the panel on the end of the cabinets really dresses up the kitchen. It's the same box, folks. It's the same box. We simply put on a cabinet panel on the end of it. Now we're going to go to a different one. This one was a pickled kitchen built in the early 1990s like so many of them. I, I don't think there's been a pickled kitchen that's been installed in 15 years or so. See how plain the boxes were. See how plain the balance was above the kitchen sink. That's the only thing we replace in here. When you, you get into this, you'll, you'll see what I'm talking about. The only thing that we replaced in this entire kitchen was the balance above the kitchen sink. Everything else has been rehabbed all the way down to the rope trim underneath those cabinet doors. So those are all brand new doors with a factory finish on them. And this is what the island looks like. We put, Of course, we put granite on there. But the island itself, the box, is still the same box. We simply put panels, pieces, and parts on it. And now you can see the new valance above the kitchen sink there. We'll, we'll hone, on, hone in on that in just a minute. We put in granite countertops, of course. And that feature right in the middle there, that's the dishwasher. We put a panel on it so it had a handle at the top. And it looks like one of the cabinets. Now here is the valance above the kitchen sink. That's the only thing in here that was really replaced in, in its entirety. You see the panels on the side of the, the uh, oven uh, cabinet. Now this is the island. This is what's so fantastic you, when you come in there. It's uh, just a beautiful, beautiful bar. And you can see the, the uh, peninsula and the island together there. Put in features such as uh, uh, seated class to make that a real feature cabinet in the corner with light there's that balance above the kitchen uh, sink again. Now, we're going to go do some befores and afters. This is the before with the pickled and the green laminate, and then this is the final product. I think everyone viewing this will agree that it's really quite a transformation without having to replace the kitchen. That's, that's what's so important. Here's the peninsula and the bar before, and here it is afterwards. What a transformation. Here's the valance above the kitchen sink before. 
here's the balance now. I mean, folks, it's just it's just too too easy to do this if uh, if your kitchen still works like you need it to work. It, the, you've still got the same appliances that you always needed. Thanks for watching our video.